You're watching Synthenos play L.A. Noir by Rockstar Games. Viewer discretion is advised. I think I heard a swears. Oh, -ho, somebody's gonna be detective. Boom, boom, pachoo. Got that one. Feel. <laughs> it's like the, it's like some sort of game, uh, like TV show. Phelps. <laughs> Fighting crime on the streets. Phelps. <laughs> I'd watch that. All right. Uh, so. All good. I think we, I think we did it. Huzzah. Ooh. A new story unfolds. Here we are at the police station. Ooh, a nice shiny suit. This is the jail, isn't it? Yeah. Or jail. That too. Maybe Here's your desk, thing. kid. You're on hey. traffic. The hot sheet is posted here next to the map. What's his problem? That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss is about. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes past my place? They haven't even approved the money yet, kid. The bond issue won't be till December. It'll be years before any of this will happen. Here's your new partner, Stefan Burkowski. I've heard all about you, Phelps. What up, Stefan? Go easy on me and let me earn the odd citation, and maybe we'll get along fine. I'm here to learn, detective. Oh, he's an intense one, isn't he, Mel? He's intense. The newly minted detective here, Cole Phelps. Flashy suits, Hi, Phelps. sir. I'll be keeping an eye on you. I could spend a little time basking in reflected glory. Make a change from busting hookers and dope fiends. Wow. Who was that, Commander? Roy Earl, chief detective and advice. Do they all dress like movie stars? Well, Roy is a movie star. And the whole of the seedy side of LA is his audience. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Stick with me, kid. You'll find We're a bit uptight. <laughs> We're definitely a bit uptight. And now some housekeeping. Warm Central Division, welcome for Detective Cole Phelps. Yay. Yay! Some of you guys may know Phelps. He's the cop who broke the jewelry store murder. Stand up and take a bow, Phelps. Uh, if it's all right with you, That's sir. That's an order, Phelps. Ooh. Shh, shh, quiet, everybody. <laughs> Phelps is one of only two serving <laughs> LAPD great. officers who received the Silver Star during the war. Really gave it those lousy Japanese, That's eh, Phelps? That's a big deal. Uh, I did my best. Good job, dude. Captain. Why are you war heroes always so modest? I partnered Phelps with everybody's favorite pole, Stefan Bukowski. <laughs> Hope you like work, kid. Bukowski sure as hell doesn't. Well, that's why we have partners, right? <laughs> okay, okay, can it, guys. Stick with Bukowski. He's a good cop. He knows traffic inside now. I'm going to start you out with one case. Do okay? I'll give you a couple more. You screw Sounds up, good. you'll be rousing vagrants and running license plates. Now get down to the P.E. Freight Depot, 6th and Alameda. A patrolman called in a suspicious vehicle. Alameda. Signs of foul play. See that what you can I've find out. Alameda, California. Come on, Phelps. Then again, we Thank are playing L.A. Noir, so... Never saw hmm. All right, investigate P.E. Freight thing. Exit. I'm glad they put these exit signs right outside. They really pushed you through quick, didn't they? Hello, Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What do you want me to say? I didn't ask for any favors. We are such a strict no fun zone. Canary says he'll sing, but only if I guarantee he walks. No fun zone at all. I'm no hood. I'm Whatever. Okay. Phelps. Hey, fuck you, asshole! Isn't that the cop who solved the big case and got promoted. Yep, that's me. Yes, we are that cop. You know this place? Room, room. Sure. Near the old gas works and signal depot. Ooh, and I unlocked warehouse a new car. Out of 95? I'll direct. This is going to be Keep awesome. going on this road. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Sarah's. Any unit to so, have code 2 So, tell me a little about yourself, Phelps. Are we friends now, Bukowski? We have to work together. Don't Jeez, be so touchy. Phelps. I grew up in San Francisco. My father was in shipping. I went to college at Stanford. Did two years ROTC before Reno CS at Camp Elliott. Shipped out in early 45 as a first lieutenant and fought in the Okinawa campaign. I was wounded, shipped back home. Did a year on the beat, straight through at the next junction. Oops. I wouldn't feel safe in a tank with you driving. <laughs> Oops. 
Cross over, keep going straight. So you won the Silver Star. I don't want to talk about it. Now let me get this straight. You single-handedly killed 40 Japs on this hill in Okinawa. No, you were up there all night, draped in the flag, knife between your teeth, gun at the ready. You finished? The Emperor Hirohito himself leading the charge against you. I did my part, Mikowski. What did you do? I kept the streets of L.A. safe for the people. Yeah, now I get it. Unfit for service. All units of 459 just occurred at 6 You're so mean. Any I know. I don't want to hang out with this. 11 King, go ahead, KGP. I'm responding to this call first. I saw it pop up. Up on the roof, officer. He has a mask on his face. I caught sight when he shoved past me, but be careful. I saw him waving a gun. All right, ma'am. Thank you. I like your sweater. No joke, he is wearing a mask and holding a gun. She is an accurate describer. Prepare to be now. subdued. Take it easy on yourself. Get the hell away from me. Where do you go? I don't know, we're taking forever to we we just didn't even fireman slide down that. Uh do I tackle subdue this man? Well, we sure as heck aren't supposed Hurry, to shoot him. Can still catch you. I think you broke my nose. I'm trying to follow his red dot. There he is. Uh oh. Oh, oh, buddy. Listen, we're not allowed to shoot. This is kind of crazy, actually, what's going on here. Run, run, run. I'm running. You can only run so fast. I feel like if we have an attitude like that, we should also be like a peak physical specimen. Oh, well, oh, hostage on, situation. Flatfoot. Let's negotiate. Uh oh. Put okay. the weapon down. Maybe we now. should have shot him. Uh oh. Uh oh. Incapacitate the suspect. Okay, so we got. You want to back off right no, now? No, don't shoot that guy. Got him. Nailed it. I hope we don't get in trouble for that. Although incapacitate more was like shoot with a headshot. That's incapacitated. Yep. Look at everyone's faces. They're like, what did you just do? You're like, you really thoroughly incapacitated that guy. Whoops. But anyway. Street on. crime complete. But back to that other crime. Oh, we got an extra intuition point. Oh good, we need them. Yeah, we do. Right turn, coming up. <laughs> <laughs> we should use our siren, that's cool. Turn right when you can. Ah! <laughs> Where did that down. come from? You were supposed to turn right. Did he? Yeah, that's why he said Take turn right. right. Well, I'm looking at the flag as well. I'm kind of like taking his vice impartial. You're supposed to listen to the guy. Because look, it's right here. Listen, Phelps. Listen. This attitude isn't going to get you far. I'm here now, aren't I? All right, you got lucky once. That you, Bukowski? Go on through. Bukowski. Straight ahead. And this new sharpshooter. This hot shot guy sitting next to him. I need to get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling this in. I'm just Whoa. a working stick. Just give him your story and you'll be all right. That's a lot of blood. I thought it was rust. It's blood? Yeah. That is bad. It's like someone, like, had a broken this bag full case, of blood folks. and just spun okay, in circles inside that stops. car. You don't know what to do next? Just so come talk to me. put a body in a blender. We'll see what we No do. lid. Well, that's, that's gross. Thanks, Stefan. That's You're just okay. gross. Yeah, they probably didn't have blenders then. <laughs> no Hawaiian breeze? Hamilton Beach. Hamilton Beach. Hawaiian Breeze. Hawaiian Breeze is a lovely fan. Officer Hart. Uh, well, whatever. <laughs> what have you got? Abandoned car. Probably stolen. <laughs> Close enough. The solid citizen is Nate Wilkie. He called it in. What gives with the corner? Yeah, what gives? There's blood all over the interior. Someone's copped the full Broderick, but no stiff as yet. We have an owner for the car? The car is registered to an Adrian Black, just north of Bunker Hill. All right. We'll take a look around. 
I'll keep Mr. Wilkie talking, oh, but don't make him wait too long. He's the restless type. All right. Nice day for it. No, don't bother him first. Don't bother him first. Go look How around. How gonna keep me here, sir? That was the mistake we've I made before. Better get back to work, sir. Doc. Detective Phelps. What have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force injury. Whoa. It must be in a very bad way. Any sign of the guy? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. Did you check that? How's the world looking? So let's see. Is he in the trunk of the car? Um, Survey go says. Yes. You no. You? Weapon is. Hmm. Tire iron. I've got a mystery sample waiting at the lab. Practical jokers say it's contaminated soil. My guess. Live Mr. hog. F. It's a Morgan. pig. Live pig yesterday? Is that pig blood? Maybe it's pig blood. Let's hope it's pig blood. Not for the pig, but... Yeah, not for the pig's sake, huh? Sorry, pig. Incidental. Yeah, incidental. Okay, well, I guess you would need it to change the tire. But we should look for evidence before we talk to that guy. I'm looking in here. What do you see? Any pig snouts? Victim looks to have lost a lot of blood. Bet you the victim's a pig. I hope it is. Although I do like pigs. Hmm. Where else should we look for clues? Maybe where the car hit the pole? Oh, over here. So you're right. Oh, well, pigs don't wear glasses. Hmm, nor do they carry wallets. Adrian Black. She's got like an Happier evil times, I guess. Evil look there, huh? Yeah. With Drew Carey back there. Aww. What a nice couple. Adrian Black. Oh, we got the address. Old, All right, married. so we gotta go see her. Sounds like an average guy. What was he doing there? Right here? Adrian is a dude, I guess. No, no, no. It says interview Mrs. Black. So Adrian is our victim, our oh. theoretical victim. Oh, he's a little bit slightly piggy, maybe. Okay, yeah. Oh, his glasses are broken. Just like Piggy in Lord of the Flies. Piggy! Oh, no. Maybe this is all a metaphor. Wait. A simile? No, an illusion. Literary illusion. Cynic doce? Now you're just getting fancy. <laughs> Hyperbole? <laughs> Alright, anything? Ah, yes. Mm. Yes, these, of course. Hello, spectators. I've got friends that work. Whoa! Oh, that looks murdery. The brand name might give us something to go on. Well, so what's going good on thing we there? have one. Tell us what the hell is going on? All right, so should probably go talk to that guy. Hey, Flatfoot, you're looking to get rid of that old crate? I'll give you a nickel for it. Ha! <laughs> huh. There's so attitudey out here. Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. You found the vehicle? I feel like he's vehicle? telling the truth. Sure. Yeah, Nate seems so legit. So I'm just sitting there. Strange place to be parking your car. Figured I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. So I called the police. Nate seems all right with me. Let's see, knowledge of your black, cards, wallet, blood, same pipe. Um... I would start with why he's there, maybe. Yeah. Mind legit. if I ask what you were doing out here? Well, I work for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckon I'd take a shortcut. I say that's true. That's true. That's totally true. He seems all right. Did you see anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging around the car? Nope. I hadn't seen a soul all day till you boys turned up. Okay. I guess I would start with... Try that, you think? Well... He wouldn't yeah. know about the contents of the wallet. Wouldn't know about the bloodstained pipe, you think. Unless he found it, but I would just ask him if he knows about the guy. Yeah, why not? That seems fair. Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. That ain't a name I'm familiar with. Yeah, that's true. Okay. You ever seen the car before? Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. I know most of the cars that park here regular, so it kind of stood out. This guy seems all right with me. Yeah, I like this guy. Well, I would just maybe keep going down the list. Okay. The wallet by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? 
You accusing me of something, I'm mister? Nuts. Did we make him mad? I, I don't think he did anything. I don't think it is. It's, how do we answer that? Truth, I guess? Truth? Like, we don't think he's shady? Yeah. It's a simple question, Mr. Wilkie. I wouldn't know what was in that wallet. I, I never touched it. Okay. You guys asked him about the pipe. We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. Do you know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. Good, good call on that one. When you saw the blood, was just going it wet, straight down the line. Bright red yeah. or uh, darker like it is now? Darker, I'd say. Look dry already. Good man, good All witness. Right, thanks, Thank dude. you for your help, Mr. Oh, we didn't get one of them right. Contact your employer. I guess if we, we need anything more from we you. We weren't supposed to. If you have to, he I must guess. have taken something out of the wallet. I can't really I don't spend no more time over this. You can have the dollars, dude. It's somebody's cool. got to inform the wife, Phelps. If you're done here, we'll Whoop. head over there. Now. All right, let's uh, let's head out, inform that wife. Ugh, this is the rough part of the job. Yeah. Wait up, bro. Hold E to make your partner drive. Heck yeah. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Fine. Where are we headed? All right. Let's see. We've got the... Uh, free, yeah, the black residence. Click that. All right. All right, set his destination. Sweet, I could just let him drive the entire time. You oh. should always do that. I mean, maybe not always, but some of the always. Often, often, if not most, most times. Ah, the black residence. Yo, Adrian. No, Adrian's dead. Yo, Adrian's wife. Yo, Mrs. Adrian. Yo, Mrs. Adrian. Let's go introduce ourselves. Oh, her garden is you lovely. Talk to her Phelps. I'm All not right. good at this shoulder to cry on stuff. All right, so we are here at Mrs. Black's residence. We will continue on with this in the next episode. There's obviously plenty of episodes up to this point, um, and we will continue on with the story later. Um, I'm just not ready to tell Mrs. Black yet. Yeah, we just can't face that. I need a moment. There's so much blood. And who knows, Adrian might even be here. And, and she might have been excited for that pig roast, and I just I yeah. don't want to disappoint her. So And look, she's sitting right there. She uh, doesn't even know what's coming. Is she, is she nude? No, she's wearing like a... Wake up, Cole. Oh, oh, no. Oh, that, all right. That's our signal. Well, we're going to head on out. Thank you for watching, as always. This is Synthenos. And Tiny Mo Jones. Until next time, have a great day. Be safe.